What is up, beautiful people? First of all, thank you very much for today's suggestion. As you know, I did a poll a couple of weeks ago, if not a week ago, and a lot of you guys told me to have a look at 2PM. Now, I have never heard of the group. I don't even know if it's a male group or a female group, but that's something we're going to find out today. But for today's video, I do know one thing. We're going to look at the video, Make It. I'm really excited for it because a lot of you guys told me to have a look at this group. And like I say, your suggestion is really important. So I would just say, if you have any music suggestions, K-pop related or not, Put them in the comments below. That's the best way for me to find out. And on top of that, if you do want to support the channel and indicate to me that you want to see more videos like this, then all you have to do is make sure you hit the like button, make sure you're subscribed, and of course, be there on the next video. I love how the community is growing day by day, and it just makes making YouTube videos so much more fun. It's really, really engaging for me. But for today's video, I would just say, let's not waste any more time, and let's jump right into 2 p.m. and make it. So before we start the video itself, like always, we're just going to watch the video in peace. We're not going to cut it. We're not going to edit it so you guys can see my real life reaction. I might pause on the go, guys. Don't hate me for it. This just allows me time to analyze things and explain certain situations if there are any or if there's anything I like or dislike. For now, I do know that it's a male group. Again, I might be wrong. This is only the first image, but I am curious what it has to offer. I would just say let's jump right into it and see what it has to offer. It's a bit pixelated though, but that could just be my internet. Ooh, very nice technique here. Do you see her in the in the in the reflection here of the of the glass? Very nice. You can see that the person is walking closer to him, whether they are in the same location or not. I think this is a glass panel. I'm not really sure, but they did a good job here in adding her to it. Very nice. You know, it makes the story come closer to one another. Okay. I mean, this really just went from zero to hero, you know, in less than a second. Like, what What happened? Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. We just saw a city getting destroyed, and now we're in an office building that is semi-destroyed? Huh? But I do like the shot itself. I love how wide it is. You can see all the members. Let's continue. Beautiful. Very nice shots, actually, here, you know, very nice beauty shots. Okay, i be honest, I didn't even notice the meteoroid falling in the background, but I think it's going to be a repeating theme throughout the entire video. Very nice editing, though. Or not even editing, well, it's somehow half editing, half post work, and half holding the camera, but just have a look. How the camera follows the movements of the choreography. Really nice. Whoa, what was that for transition? Sorry, guys. We're pausing a lot, but... Is... That's a clean transition. Really good focus. They made sure that the eyes are basically the transition points. Really good. Really, really, really clean. Very nice. That's a bit creepy though, you know, if someone starts looking at you like that and just go... <sighs> just my personal taste, but it adds to the story. She's being looked at by multiple men. Maybe she likes it. Kind of cool, you know, that here you can see that this is a real life set. And I don't know how much is fake of it. I cannot say that, but... Do you guys see, for example, here, there's like air. Do you guys see that, actually? Let me move myself, actually, so you guys can see it. Uh, let's try this all. Do you see, like, this air coming out of the place here? Do you see it? Like, something is blowing out all this dirt. That's how they make this all look so catastrophic. A lot of air, bursts of CO2 or bursts of air. I don't know what they use, in all honesty, but it's just blam bamming a lot of stuff into the air really nice though a little bit maybe they could have put it a little bit backwards to not show like the co2 or the gas coming out but it's totally fine as well okay i can go back into my position again let's continue but it's still nice how they do it a lot of these things are practical effects and i like that practical effects are always better than cgi and always I really love the color palettes as well. It's very nice and simple on the eyes. 
I still think there are too many videos, especially in K-pop, where some of the colors are just too bright and they pop a little bit too hard, which makes it very hard on the eyes for you to see what's actually happening. I'm not a big fan of that, but for this video, it's very clean, very nice and very neutral. They did a good job on it. Sometimes there is a bit of a, a heat difference, so a temperature difference, sometimes a little bit too blue and sometimes a little bit too yellow, but I think that's because of the storytelling. Everything that's a little bit warmer, she is involved. Every time it's a little bit more blue, AKA a little bit more cold, it's more about the choreography and the group themselves. You see here, for, let's just go and I'll explain it. That's easiest to do, but this is a little bit warmer. She's there. And now we come to the choreography. It's a little bit more blue. It's a little bit more colder. See, now it's yellow again because she is there. But I like that. It's easier to follow what's happening. LP cooking wine and Wait, what? LP cooking. Okay, sorry. I was thinking he was saying LPing. LP, you know, the, the big disc to listen to music. I love LPs, by the way. We have a massive collection at home. A little bit of an issue that I see with this part of the video. Let's go back a little bit. It's actually... His hair is way too dry for the situation. I mean, his clothes are just soaked in clothes. But why is his hair not? And I get it, you know, he has to look good. But for the effect or for the time, for this particular shot, why not just make him purely wet? Because it's just weird how everything is super wet. You can see, you know, it's soaked. Except for his head. But okay, that's uh, something I would have picked up. And maybe just say, dude, just become wet completely. Very beautiful transitions though, and it's very smooth transitions. They're fantastic. Because they always use a person as a reference point for a transition, making it much easier to follow because you keep looking in the same location, aka if one person is the main center, you'll be the same center point for the next scene, which is amazing for the transitions. Looks amazing. <laughs> I love these little subtle movements from the camera, by the way, that happen, um, that go with the choreography. It seems as if, like I already said, you know, the cameraman is part of the choreography or the editing is part of the choreography. Really nice. They did a really good job here. Like, you can see what is real and what is a little bit of CGI. But it's fantastic, you know, like this glass breaking, most likely CGI, everything here where there's like a dust cloud popping up, as you can see by the direction here, it's going like this, it's going into the air because they have like a cannon here blasting everything up, but it's totally fine. It looks really good. Can someone just explain the story to me? Because I have a feeling if you don't understand the words they're saying it really just seems and i have subtitles on but it's hard for me to focus on both but for me it feels like her ignoring them is like the world being destroyed am i right am i wrong is this what i'm supposed to feel with the video like if i only have to analyze the video it, it's a very touchy video but is this also what they're trying to portray with the lyrics just put it in the comments below if, if i'm right or wrong <laughs> Oh yeah, here we go. I can't let you walk past me. So they are a little bit upset that she is ignoring them. That's okay though. That's a very intense feeling though, that you think the world is being destroyed. And they don't even care about the situation if the world is being destroyed. Very nice choreography though, very uplifting, very positive, very bouncy, very nice. I'm really happy though as well, small little details but very important for storytelling. Remember when, uh, am I going backwards? There we go. Remember when he was getting caught in the face? I still think it's nice that they brought this back again two times because why else would he have been cut? It's nice that they keep on adding it to it. Just to remember what happened in the past, how we got cut with the glass, 
Very nice little details like this are important in video making. Very good. Keeping it consistent. Super cool how they made this look as if it was part of the window. I mean, let's go back to it again. I mean, it doesn't it get put in there. Like first you don't see it, but then it's as if he's standing in front of a window. And you can see that there's a window. There's a bit of dirt here, which is totally fine. But very nice how they edited this in as if that logo is part of the glass all of a sudden. And that was make it. A lot of things were happening in this video, but let's analyze it together now. So that was 2 p.m. at Make It. I have never heard of this group before, but I am intrigued to watch more of them. I think the music, you know, whether you like it or not, the music videos generally are so far very interesting. It's very different from the rest because I've never seen so many transitions, so many edits made based on the choreography. And this is really nice. I'm not sure if any of the other videos have the same styling, let's say, but I am intrigued to find out. And I like this kind of editing. I think the consistency is really spot on. They always have the same color temperatures, they always use the same reference points for transitions, and it's just beautiful to look at what they did. On top of that, I think the choreography was filmed fantastically. I think the angles they used is just great. It's always from a different bit of an angle. It's moving with the choreography, and then also it's nice and wide enough to pick up everyone. It shows that everyone is just important to the choreography, and I still think there are just too many groups that are sadly focusing sometimes too much on one member while the entire group is dancing. I don't think this is so nice because at the end of the day, it's a group effort, and here they really put the nail on the hammer and they did a fantastic job. And I appreciate it. I appreciate it when they put the stars in first, well, as a priority, you know, they are more or less the priority that it's a group and not just a singular person. But now the big question is, what do you guys actually think of the video? Do you enjoy it? Did I miss anything? Did I miss the story? Put it down below. Maybe I missed it completely. I am not really sure. Like I said, sometimes it's really hard to pay attention to the music video and the lyrics, but I think that it's always important that a video should explain the song by itself. But that's again my take and that's how I see the production of videos that you should be able to do the storytelling that is. And if I understood it correctly, I think they did a good job. It's either that because she's ignoring them, the world is falling apart, or though she's ignoring them, they need to get her attention, though the world is falling apart. That is how important she is to them. It doesn't matter in what time, what situation, they want to get her attention. I think this is very interesting. I think it's more or less very romantic. I like that. But then again, what do you guys actually think? For now, guys, thank you very much for watching. And like I said at the beginning of the video, if you have any recommendations, put them down below for me to know what you're going to review next. And if you do want to consider to support the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video. And of course, come visit me on my next video because your recommendations are being reviewed and I really, really enjoy doing this. So I'll catch you then. And of course, have a good day.